Hey friends, Dave here with Transfer Express and today we're going to be diving in to an apparel industry forecast for 2022. Now while looking forward, we're gonna have to take a moment and look back on the trends that we saw emerge this year that are setting that stage for what comes next in 2022. Sure, navigating the post-pandemic landscape was and still is challenging. It's safe to say that we're all fatigued but let's celebrate the successes of 2021 and dive into what we see coming next. If you are new to Transfer Express, we are the world's largest supplier of screen printed and digital heat transfers, heat presses, designs, apparel, and advice to help you grow your t-shirt business. If you haven't already subscribed, we are kicking out new videos just like this one every single week. Let's reflect on what 2021 meant for so many of us here in the apparel printing industry. Now, the first thing that comes to mind for people that I've talked to this year is thriving, not just surviving. The businesses that weathered the uncertainty of 2020 are doing better than they ever have. And even those new t-shirt businesses that cropped up are sharing a lot of the growth of the apparel industry as a whole. And it's even changed the lives of so many people. I am constantly floored by the stories of those people who left long-time careers, sometimes not by choice, to follow their passion and start their own t-shirt businesses. They get to spend more time at home with their loved ones, doing what they love, and not even skipping a beat on any income. That's awesome. Next up is the return of some type of normalcy. This year, with the arrival and return of the somewhat normal sports and event schedules, a lot of that work that was lost in 2020 has now returned Turn, bringing with it a good boost of old and new business to the companies that made it through the thick of it. But of course, it brought with it uh, some issues, namely the supply chain and logistical nightmares that impacted so many of us and still do to this day. From ink shortages to once reliable apparel styles completely out of stock to vendors struggling to maintain inventory or even those long logistical transit delays, we've seen firsthand how the growth of the apparel printing industry has outpaced the limited manufacturing and shipping capabilities coming out of this pandemic. There was quite a bit of pricing changes throughout the industry that rippled all the way down to the customer in 2020. From fluctuating ink pricing to inflated shipping fees and increased pricing on just about everything. I feel like it all jumped in price, even from a trip to the grocery store or just a cup of coffee. But being agile and adapting to those changes in costs helped helps you protect your profit margins. It also helps with strengthened communication with your customers. Being transparent builds that sense of trust so your customers know you're not just trying to rip them off. And if they went to another supplier or printer, they would see the similar pricing there too. Which brings us back to our 2022 apparel industry forecast. Now, while the supply and demand may start to even out, that increased pricing is most likely here to stay, especially on raw materials and transit fees. If you haven't already, it may be time to reassess your costs and pricing structures, or just look at how your process is laid out around your business or your shop. You may be able to shave some time and upfront costs off by upgrading to maybe a new shipping system or even new order processing software or better bookkeeping, all of which could still fit your business and put it in the perfect pricing sweet spot to make a minimal impact on your customers and keep all those orders flowing. Like we mentioned earlier, those inventory issues and logistical delays, <laughs> are probably gonna continue, at least into the first quarter here of 2022. While vendors may start to catch up on the shipments of inventory from overseas, the demand is still high, keeping that pressure on the entire chain that gets those blank garments and supplies from the manufacturers to the wholesalers and then to you and your business. The best practice will be to stock up, especially if you're doing on-demand printing with your online store like we've seen so many people do. 
Buying extras and overs should always be in your mind when you're checking out, if your budget allows it. Now we've seen stock available one day and gone the next. So you're gonna wanna minimize any production delays and waiting on that back ordered stock is no fun, trust me. Speaking of on-demand printing though, looking at the advancements in technology in the past couple years, the digital printing and heat applied graphics segments have just exploded. This has made on-demand and low quantity orders more affordable for customers and more profitable for us and you as decorators. Even as more advancements come out with the direct-to-film heat transfers, it's easier than ever to say yes to any job, big or small, loaded with colors, single color, gradients, or those details. 2022 is going to be a big year here for us at Transfer Express as well in that regard with the release of our own direct-to-film transfer Ultra Color Max. We'll offer no minimum quantities and sheet sizes as large as 22 inches. Now these transfers have the same capabilities as say like a direct-to-garment printer but don't require the investment or the constant maintenance that direct-to-garment or DTG machines require. You just get to use it, your heat press. On-demand printing is a great way to shift if you're running your own online store or Etsy shop. You'll be limiting the liability that you get when printing those big bulk orders. If certain styles don't sell, you could just use the extra blank apparel for the next drop and print those designs when the orders come in. In addition to those new businesses that jumped in to the heat printing industry, printing those t-shirts, we've seen a lot of larger traditional ink and squeegee screen printing shops using screen printed transfers too. These shops are leveraging transfers for jobs that don't meet the quantity minimums for their profitable automatic press operation or using them in place of skilled screen printers that have become incredibly hard to find these days. Yeah, in terms of shortages, it's not just limited to inks and apparel, labor is in high demand too. Another trend continuing into 2022, digital marketing. It's easier than ever for small businesses and creators to dip their toes into online advertising and social media marketing sharing noteworthy projects, your capabilities, or any behind the scenes content to get your company and name out there. With just a few hours of research, you could stand up low cost, profitable campaigns to expand your reach and your audience, even in your local area. One of the things that the pandemic spotlighted was how to make your business known online without in-person events or even advertising on the commute. I'm talking ads on the radio, billboards, or ads that you put on the back of your own car with vinyl. Bolstering your online presence and optimizing your website or your online stores for maximum searchability is always smart, but it will be more important than ever here in 2022. Now in terms of social media, you might think like the, it's just a bunch of junk and TikTok is just a bunch of silly dances. TikTok. but you'll be wrong. We've seen and heard from so many t-shirt decorators with online stores that just blew up in a single viral post, even those doing custom apparel too. They went from two orders a week to a steady 200 or more. They quit their full-time jobs and now they're doing what they love off one post that just went viral. So I urge you to at least try it out if you're not already. Follow some apparel brands, Etsy stores, and those print shops by just searching hashtags. Makes it super easy to see the content that you want and that's the stuff that you're gonna leverage too. Worst case scenario, you may still learn a few tips from others in the industry. Outside the business side of things, we're going to talk in terms of styles, designs, and fashion trends. There's a few that have really come up in popularity in 2021 with no signs of slowing down in 2022. 
2022. First and foremost, inside tag printing and private relabeling. Nothing kills the value of a printed t-shirt more than your customer seeing a Fruit of the Loom tag. While that specific blank may not be the same style that comes in the 12-pack at Target for $9.99, some apparel brands have built a reputation on being very inexpensive, and it's so hard to break those stereotypes when you're printing for your own brand. And with more and more apparel manufacturers creating styles with the easy tearaway tags, it's never been easier to rebrand those tees. Using screen printed transfers also completely reduces those misprints that could ruin garments when you're traditionally pulling ink on a squeegee for those inside tag locations. Next trend up, those tie-dye and ice-dyed garments. A trend that started in those small Etsy stores with hand-applied dye or bleach now has been picked up by so many apparel manufacturers with brands like Independent Trading, Porton Company, Champion, Bella Canvas, and so many more offering brand new dyed and bleached colorways here in late 2021 that eliminate the need to bleach or dye those garments yourself. The once highly niche market of bulk tie-dye garments is now mainstream, and the trend shows absolutely no sign of slowing down moving into 2022 here. With more and more companies making a return to the workplace, branded logo wear will absolutely be on the rise. Even with the teams working remotely still, company branded apparel is a great way for businesses to advertise in a much more organic format, and it helps those employees feel like a team again. Now, if you think we missed anything, and I'm almost certain there's gonna be something that we did, let us know down in the comments section below. We love hearing your unique ideas and the trends that you see in your neck of the woods. Of course, this video wouldn't have been possible without the heat printing community sharing experiences and ideas. It's beautiful and it truly floors me the amount of help there is out there for anyone looking to start their own t-shirt business. Of course, with 2022 right on the horizon, we've got a full year planned of more helpful videos along with free interactive webinars and live streams built solely with the purpose to help you and your brand succeed. I hope that we could all close the book on 2021 in stride and absolutely crush it in 2022. Be sure you're subscribed here with the Transfer Express YouTube to stay up to date on all the exciting happenings here at Stalls Transfer Express. But until next time, I'm Dave. Happy pressing.